Hello guys, in this video I want to discuss uh, Monson's view of, of Greeks and how Greeks compare to Romans and uh, this one is, you know, once again something he is not correct about, I think. Um, and in the previous video we were talking about, um, you know, kind of uh, Monson's mistaken view that um, Romans, you know, did not have mathematicians and philosophers as a consequence of their religion being different from Greek religion. Um, and in this video, I'd like to address uh, this particular issue, you know, the um, difference between Greek religion and Roman religion. So, um, and Monzen is totally mistaken here. Um, so he thinks that uh, Greeks simply had a very, you know, personal religion, like it was a close religion. Um, uh, so, you know, this really memorable passage, um, uh, in volume one, you know, he says, uh, you know, for the Greek, um, you know, when he looked up at the sky, okay, he saw the blue eye of Zeus, okay, there's, um, uh, you know, Zeus with his blue eyes, and it's very, you know, personal. It's, you know, one-on-one. -on -one. It's, um, you know, Greek citizens uh, knowing individually and personally and closely their gods. And in Rome, it was more abstract, okay? It was more remote, more intellectual, okay? And, you know, Momsen says that, um, you know, that's the difference. Like, so for... Um, you know, Greeks, um, you know, Zeus was a man, and for a Roman individual, uh, you know, Jupiter was more of a concept. So, I mean, if you think about, you know, kind of um, modern, you know, monotheistic religions, I mean, God is not a man with an old beard. God is a concept, okay? So, you know, moms and thought that you know, Roman view, even though it was, you know, still physical, you know, there were statues, um, it was more conceptual than the Greek view. All right. And, you know, that's the main difference between them. Well, this uh, view is totally, totally false. Uh, it's mistaken. Why? Well, simply because uh, it, it's just the whole thing is kind of mistaken, okay, because um, Greeks, uh, both Greek and Roman, you know, gods were physical, okay, it's not that, it is true that, you know, Greeks had a personal relationship with Zeus, but Romans did too, okay, it's not that, you know, Romans had this kind of conceptual intellectual view, it's not the case, okay, Roman religion was very much similar to Greek religion, and also, it was derived from Greek religion for, for, to a large extent. I mean, they did have their own, um, you know, practices and, you know, deities. But for the most part, it was not original, okay? So, Momsen, you know, makes it look as if, you know, Romans had their own religion, which, you know, they came up with. But they did not. They got it from the Greeks. And, you know, Greeks you know, gave this religion in the first place and Romans took it from them and, you know, changed the names for the most part. So, you know, Jupiter is Zeus. Uh, Athena is Minerva. And um, on YouTube, there is a whole bunch of, you know, good videos about, you know, these kind of uh, mappings of gods, which god corresponds to which god. Feel free to check it out. But, um, you know, Mazen is totally, totally mistaken about... Uh, you know, Roman religion being conceptual and Greek being, um, you know, physical. Uh, he is mistaken here and Spengler is correct in that Roman religion was a derivative of Greek religion. 